Are you in love? I'm not in love. There's a possibility of being wounded in the relationship. I don't think I'm ready to to face that now. Okay. So how long have you been married? Um, June will make me 20 years in marriage. Wow. You're married? I'm married. So how long have you been married? Um, June will make me 20 years in marriage. Wow, why? Like I said, nobody has come to separate us. Nobody has come to judge, not even our pastor. We've not taken our matters to the church. So I believe when I am in love. Okay, and you believe that your husband loves you? Ah, very much. Okay. Very much. Oh, he doesn't play with me. He calls me a da -Z. That is um, the, the 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 daughter of a king because of my actions in his house. Wow, so in twenty years is really a long time. So, how has marriage been in these twenty years? In my own side, it has been few downs and a lot of ups. A lot of ups in the sense that we enjoy ourselves, we understand ourselves, no quarreling. Okay, man. So, um, many young people of this age that are aspiring to marry, most of them are actually they're actually scared of getting married because they are thinking of staying with one man for the rest of their lives and how it's going to be. So, do you feel tiring to stay? with just your husband like you think it is really tiring to stay with just one man you know trying to because of course he's he's not like you 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 both are two different people so you just need understanding to stay in your marriage so do you feel it is tiring to stay with one person for these 20 years if you understand the word love i don't think you feel tired it's not tiring the main thing there is understanding your spouse when you understand you know his weak points and his pleasure time and you walk towards that you can never be tiring because the bible says one wife one husband so um sorry i'm just going to ask you this one question if you find out that your husband is cheating on you with another girl what, 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 like, what would be your reaction? Would you want to walk out of the marriage or...? Truly speaking, he cannot. But if, paraventure, he does. I don't say anything there. Um, personally, it's his desire. He gets what he wants and when he hears, tap, outside, because I am an Efak woman. Oh. When he hears, tap, he will run back. So, what's your advice for young people that are aspiring to get married? Um, if you want to get married and stay, want to be married and um, stay long in marriage like I have stayed, the, the, the number one thing is to love God, make Him the center of the marriage. Then you understand your husband. Know when he is happy. Know when he is like down if he tells you he doesn't want to talk just allow him to that period then later you can still do the talking because mainly it's not your talking because women we we tend to know a lot of things and we want to imbibe in men and a lot of them don't want to oblige because they feel you're controlling them so when you start and you see his reaction just pipe down later you can still say it or he will call you like my does and hey where was waiting me that's where you want tell me then you can now speak out thank you very much thank you i really appreciate it. do you believe true love exists I, I believe true love exists yes okay so are you in love i'm not in love why if i may ask uh, reason being that uh, I believe we should live our life based on priority. I have my priorities. For now, our relationship is not is not in my scale of preference for now. I have other things I have to do in my life. When I've settled all of that, I can then uh, focus on being in a relationship. Yeah, that's uh, the main reason.
and for the other part of it, uh, there's a possibility of being wounded in the relationship. I don't think I'm ready to to face that now. Okay, so that's the reason why. Okay, so Esosa, you're telling us today that if maybe um, you get your priorities first, yes. you can definitely fall in love, or you would easily fall in love with someone that you, you love. Know that I would easily fall in love. Okay, don't get it twisted. I'm not. I don't I'm not, I'm not saying I would easily fall in love. Either. First of all, to be in love, you, you you must be in a relationship, right? Uh -huh, you must be in a relationship. So I said, when when I get my priorities right, then I we can I can start talking about I can start giving attention to matters of emotion. Okay, I hope I'm not getting too personal, but what are these your priorities that you want to get right? Oh no, that should be that is. Uh, between me and the bedpost, okay? I totally respect that. Thank you very much.